as you can see, I've moved down. I'm approaching the feet. But I thought you might like to look at something different. I'm going to show some of what I call my country quilts. These were inspired by uh, travels in India. This is the first quilt I made. It wasn't a classic traditional quilt. I made it after going to India and seeing hanging on clotheslines quilts like this. Ratty looking, sloppy, thrown together quilts. I thought they were beautiful. I wanted to make one like it. Piecing looked like it had just been put together without any plan at all. That was very hard for me to do. I asked a neighbor if she had any cotton things to give away that were not good enough to give to Goodwill. I wanted to be completely uncaring about these fabrics. They were all unfamiliar to me, so I did, wasn't attached. And I started just sewing them together, trying not to think what went next to each other well. It was completely random. This was very difficult. I'd line up two pieces of fabric, and then I'd think, oh no, something that other one would be better here. I had to obliterate all of that kind of thinking. It never went up on the wall. This truly looks Indian. <laughs> it was an old uh, Nepalese prayer flag. It might have fared better on a Himalayan mountaintop. <laughs> 